Hey everyone, this is Max and I've received a couple of emails on how to upgrade your phone, your Windows phone, to Windows Phone 8.1 if it is currently not available through your provider. Well, um, I have a Nokia 928 and the update to Windows Phone 8.1 is currently not available for both Verizon and Nokia Windows phones. So, let's do it ourselves. First things first, go to this website appstudio.windowsphone.com and go ahead and sign in with the same Windows Phone email or email that you use for your phone and for me I use my Gmail account go ahead and sign in voila um, you'll be asked if you want to join the program go ahead and click yes and from there it should take you to a web page like this one where you can choose to start creating your application. The next thing you want to do is either on your phone or on your computer um, go to windowsphone.com to download this application called Preview for Developers. And basically as we see here on the description now registered Windows Phone developers can receive pre-release OS updates on their developer's phone. So now that you are registered as a developer through this App Studio program, you are able to download the updates bypassing the network security in place by your service provider. All right, so there you go. And here's the requirement. You must have an active Windows Phone developer account or B, have an active App Studio account which is what we signed up for. So you can go ahead and install this, click install, or you can install it on your phone directly. Alright, so now we're gonna go ahead and move on to our phone and install it from there. Hey, hey everyone, so basically as soon as you have signed up online, um, next thing you want to do from the application store is go ahead and download this application called Preview for Developers. And this is completely free since you've signed up online. Um, I've already logged in with my email address, which I which you've used to sign up for the Windows Phone Developer Program. Now you just click Enable Preview for Developers, click on Done, and this basically finalizes um, your enrollment in a developer's program. So now we can download 8.1. Windows Phone 8.1. So now, follow the instructions. Go ahead and go to Settings, About, More Info, No, Phone Update. <laughs> Check for updates. And this is particularly problematic for Verizon phones. Um, I still haven't received my update, so this is a way to definitely speed up the process and get your 8.1 um, update on your Nokia phone immediately. And voila, so now I am updating to 8.1. Yay, quite excited about that. Um, especially if you've been reading all over the news, Cortana and all the various new futures that haven't hasn't arrived on Verizon Nokia phones. Okay, give it some more time. Well, since we have some time, um, if you're doing this, what is the um, future that you're most up excited about with Windows 8.1? Uh, for me, it's primarily Cortana and the live notifications update. Um, I really didn't like the notification system that was currently in place with Windows 8 and um, hopefully um, it's improved. Um, I've seen it on various YouTube videos, but of course it's a lot different to actually have it um, on hand. Right, this phone is almost done updating. Well, this particular uh, model of Nokia, I have the Nokia 928, and I love my Nokia phone. Great pictures, great camera, but hopefully this new um, update makes it even 
a better phone. Voila, your update is ready to be installed. Install. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pause this for now and give you an update. All right, guys, after our first update, we have updated to 8.0.1521.155. So you're going to basically keep updating until you get to 8.1. All right. Phone update. Here we are installing our second update, and that's almost done. All right, now it's installing, and wait for it to restart. And hold on a moment. All right, here we are after, well, our second update is on our way. We have this notification, and basically, this says Windows Phone, blah, blah, blah. This will make it easier to update your phone to Windows 8.1 install all right this is going to take some time again so let me pause the video all right so this is after the second update and i just started up the phone your update is all done you're all set to get the new phone updates including the latest one windows phone 8.1 we'll check for it shortly but if you can't wait which of course we can't setting phone updates check for updates yippee and for me, I actually take out my SIM card um, when I do my updates, just so that it doesn't use my data and use my Wi-Fi instead, just in case. Um, let's see here, settings, phone update, yippee! Checking for updates. So I have my Wi-Fi enabled. Um, basically this process so far has taken about 10 minutes. So if you're in a hurry, um, you might wanna just sign up online, get your developer account ready, even download the application online. So when you start your phone, you can go ahead and sign in um, through the developer apps and then update, update, update. Um, and also, Make sure your phone is charged. Um, you definitely do not want to have low battery while you're upgrading your phone. That can definitely cause problems while you are upgrading. Okay, so here we are checking for updates. Boop, 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 boop. Let's see. Well, hope you guys had an awesome weekend. Um, it's Sunday, 11.49 here in Spain. All is good. Nice sunny day. All right, um, I'm not sure how long this is gonna take, so I'll go ahead and pause this video one more time. All right, so um, the last um, download and ready to update install took about 10 to 15 minutes. And now the final update is ready to be installed. Um, there's a warning here, this should take about 15 to 30 minutes, but could take longer. So basically, Go ahead and click install. Make sure your battery is charged. Please make sure your battery is charged. And that's it. Um, let's see here. I'll pause this video for a couple seconds and we'll see our new eight Windows Phone 8.1. Thanks. All right, everyone, the moment of truth. Um, the phone has been updating for approximately 16 minutes. And so, Yay, Windows 8.1. F-bomb, yeah. All right, so here it is. It's restarting, and now it should be running Windows 8.1. See the Nokia display. Um, Verizon, thanks again for not updating our phones as fast as we would like considering the Windows Phone update has been available for quite some, well, not quite some time, but a couple of weeks now, I think. Okay, start screen. Okay. 
We are getting there, and it'll be worth the wait. Migrating your data, step two, step three out of 19. All right. <laughs> um, so if you're gonna update your phone, make sure you have at least an hour. Um, yeah. Um, if anything, you can always update, leave the phone, put it down, charge it, do something else check on your phone, install the update, and so forth. And even when you think that your phone is almost ready, um, this migrating your data happens after every single update. So this is actually the third update um, for my Windows phone, Nokia Lumia 928 through Verizon. And hopefully, well, it will be worth the wait. <laughs> Okay, so the rest is going pretty fast. Step seven, eight, nine, well, nine, ten, whatnot. Um, let's see here. Well, pretty much, um, I don't think you really have to watch the rest of the video. Um, pretty much, it's just the steps to actually getting your phones updated. And yeah, um, if you like the video, click thumbs up. If you have any questions, post them in the comment section and I'll definitely do my best to respond to you and help you get your phone to Windows 8.1. All right, I'm gonna pause the video again and yeah, come back once it's updated. Everyone, um, so let's see here. The last update um, took a little bit of time, but here we are. Update successful, and let's see here. New settings, your Wi-Fi sense connects to your Wi-Fi to help you save cellular data. Sure, why not? Microsoft updates, backups are now included in your app content. Some of your settings and passwords may be syncing across, mo across your Microsoft devices. Um, let's see here, additional options, automatically connect to Wi-Fi, yes. Allow me to exchange Wi-Fi network access with my contacts. Automatically update store apps. So that's pretty awesome. Um, let updates use my advertising ID for experience across apps. Sure, why not? Yes. Oh, our first text message. Hi, the to find out about what's fun about Windows 8.1. Voila. So just to double check, um, I have a lot of applications updating now. Go ahead and click on settings. Sorry about that. Uh, settings. About, about, about. Where are you? About. Voila. More info, and now we are running Windows 8.1. Yippee! All right, well, thank you guys for watching. Sorry about the long tutorial video. Um, if you guys have any questions, um, once again, don't forget to post a comment. And voila, thank you guys again for watching. Take care, bye-bye.